Beth Narvez, DODIA's Chief Academic Officer. I'm Michelle Brahaney. I'm the Director for Student Excellence in Europe. I'm Dr. Judy Miner, Director for Student Excellence in DODIA Americas. You know, I have two um, women in history who really inspire me. Uh, the first is Helen Keller. As a child, I read about her and just became really inspired and intrigued by her story and how she and Ann Sullivan worked together to overcome a really significant disability. She went on to be a teacher, um, an author, and reflecting now, I think that's probably something that significantly contributed to me being an educator. There are many female role models, but the one I was particularly drawn to was Mother Teresa. And here's the reason why she, she really had a noble mission of, of care and concern. And I think that is, is so important in, with what we do in, in pre-K-12 schools. Also, I think she, I, I appreciated how she served with humility. I think that is also very important. So Deborah Meyer um, created a small school um, in New York City called Central Park East Secondary School. And so I was a, a new teacher and just reaching out for any resource, right, to help me become a better teacher. And I came across her book, The Power of Their Ideas, which was about her creation of this school and how she was trying to make a school where students were so well known, where students had a voice, where they were engaging in really innovative and authentic practices. And I just felt so inspired by her creativity. So about half of our students are girls. Um, and we are about teaching kids what's possible for their future. So girls can see those role models and see, hey, that's a possibility for me. We have to remember that we're serving as role models for uh, both our students and for our workforce. Um, historically, women have been underrepresented in uh, leadership positions and um, you know, we're preparing our students for the future and we want both our male and female students to realize the leadership capacity of women. Providing women with the excellence of opportunities um, where they can uh, try new things, apply themselves in, in various ways, um, I think that's very important, as well as the work that we're currently engaged in with our diversity, equity, and inclusion committees at the headquarters, at region, as well as the district levels. Uh, those are important ways that women can have a voice as to how they can further advance and contribute to the work of DODIA. I think it's important as leaders that we know our employees well. Just like I was inspired by Deborah Meyer, who created a school where students were known well, I believe that we owe our employees uh, the ability for them to be known well, to know their expertise, to know their talents, and to tap their talents and expertise. In my career, I've had just wonderful mentors, uh, both men and women throughout my entire career. So I would uh, tell women to find a mentor who they trust, who they can learn with, and who they can relate to. I would want women to know that the sky is the limit for them and to just pursue whatever they want to do. I think the biggest piece is to always keep learning, um, whether it's reading, whether it's podcasts, whether it's it's listening and, and, and touching base with different stakeholders, keeping that thirst for lifelong learning is really an important piece as to how um, women can continue to develop in their careers. I always hope right, that I leave a place better than I found it, right, that I can contribute. Um, that's all you try to do is to do your best and can contribute to it. And I think that a real mark of a leader 
is your ability to grow other leaders. So I hope that that's what I'm able to leave as my legacy, uh, whether it's students, um, other teachers, leaders throughout the organization, I hope they have grown and they're better um, because of our relationship. I hope when people think about me as an educational leader, they'll remember my commitment and my passion for learning. I hope that they'll remember that every student will be successful as long as the adults come together to make that happen. For me, um, I would hope people would look back and say, to the very best of her ability, she worked to make the vision of DoDEA come true, of excellence and education for every student, every day, everywhere. <laughs>